everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name's Courtney and today I'm going to be doing a cash envelope stuffing video. Um, it is going to be just a little bit different because um, I spent some of my money before I did this video. Um, but that was because there was a snowstorm on two, or Thursday and Friday. So um, I just got to the bank today and then I had to get groceries. Um, so things are going to be just a little bit different. But um, I did want to shout out that I have cash envelopes available on my Etsy shop, which is linked down below. Um, so let's get started. Um, I did use all of my grocery money already, um, so there's nothing in this and I am going to set it aside. Um, and then I did use some of my spending money to splurge on steak that was not in my grocery budget. So um, this has already been stocked and I've used $20 of it. Um, so that is also going to go off to the side. Next I have my gas envelope which um, I use this to track exactly what bills go in my envelope. Um, so this one gets $60 and it gets two 20s, a 10, a 5, and 5 ones. This is um, because I ride with my sister a lot to work and I like to have small bills to give her for gas when I need to. Um, so 20, 40, 50, 5. 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Now these are the four envelopes that I keep in my wallet at all times. They're my four most used envelopes. Um, and then the last one is my date night envelope. This one I use for my boyfriend and I to split um, date nights. He hates it when I pay, but um, I do it anyway. So this gets 50. And it gets a 20, two tens, five, and five ones um, because we will split it so that I pay tip and he pays dinner or the other way around. Um, so I like to have some ones. So I have 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. Okay, so the last things that I fill are my sinking funds, which if you've watched my videos before, you know they are my designated um, cash envelope savings accounts. Um, so I save for specific reasons, and um, that is all that I use for whatever that reason is. Um, so these are my two favorite cash envelopes, they're my garden envelope and um, my boyfriend's envelope so that I can buy him nice things every once in a while. Um, these both get $10, so I'm going to put $10 in my garden envelope and I will go ahead and take out what's already in here. So in my garden envelope right now I have $20, 30 40 50 $60. Um, I'm saving up to um, improve my garden this year um, by having better like trellises and stuff like that to uh, stake my tomatoes on. So that is what that envelope is for. And I recently took my boyfriend out for his birthday so that has nothing in it right now. So I'm just going to put $10 in this one. Um, these envelopes are also available on my Etsy shop. Um, I think they're super cute because they have the honeybees and the, um, the garden pictures on them. So if you are a gardener um, and you want to save up for your own garden or your own apiary, um, these might be some good cash envelopes for you. Um, so please check out the link down below if you're interested. Next is my car envelope. Um, there is $20 in here and I'm going to add another $20. However, I am 
bringing my car to the shop on Monday because I need new brakes. So um, this $40 plus my tax return is being used to get new brakes. Um, next is gifts. This one has $30 in it right now and I'm going to add 10 to it. This is for Christmas, um, birthdays, anniversary, um, anything that I'm giving a gift for. Once Christmas gets closer, I will make a separate envelope for Christmas, um, but until then, this is how I plan to do it. Um, today is the 29th, so happy Leap Day. Um, there's $40 in there. Um, some of my envelopes do have trackers and then others don't. Um, I'm a big fan of the trackers just so that way if I need to know what's in the envelope um, immediately, I don't have to count it every time. Um, I can just look at the back. Next is my travel envelope. Um, these are some of my newer or my first edition envelopes, so they're not nearly as well done. but. This one also gets $10, and I'm going to count this. I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30. So there's 130 in here right now. Um, I think we want to go camping this summer, so I'll probably use it for camping. Um, this is our way of having fun without going over budget. Um, so I, I think it is important to have kind of like a travel envelope or a fun envelope so that way you're not completely depriving yourself of fun things while you're budgeting, but, um, this is our way of doing it. And lastly, I have my apartment fund. Um, I need to swap these out for hundreds soon because there's just, it's getting really thick. Um, so I'm not going to... Uh, count that all but I am putting $40 in there um, my boyfriend and I both put $40 in here every other week so we can save up for our own apartment so this is just my contribution for right now um, he'll do it later so there is now $600 in the envelope and lastly, I have my debt snowball envelope, which um, because I used all of the money in my cash envelopes um, that I showed first, I don't have anything to contribute to this today, but I do still have, um, what is it, 30, I have $31 in here um, that will be going towards my debt snowball. So, um... It's not a ton, but it does give me a reason to stick to my budget a little bit more um, because I know that if I don't spend all my money, uh, whatever's left over gets put in here and gets put into my debt snowball. So um, you can see the last time that I withdrew out of this, I had $206. I will tell you that that went towards my wheel bearing and not my debt snowball, but um, it would have gone towards my debt snowball if I didn't need to replace a wheel bearing. So, um, I will put this in my bank account at the end of the week and I will deposit, um, $31 towards my debt snowball and, uh, it's little but it does compound and it does help even a little bit. So, um, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. It helps my channel a ton and... If you're interested in cash envelopes, like I said, there is a link to my Etsy shop down below. <laughs> Sorry about that. We're cooking uh, Brussels sprouts. Um, but if you are interested in cash envelopes, there is a link down below. Uh, please leave a comment if you have something specific you'd like to see in my channel. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!